we present a regional hydrogen concept in the commercial sector for the use of PV yield. We're using the example of a PV carport system with charging station operation at the environmental campus Birkenfeld, Trier University of Applied Sciences, which is located in Western Germany. It is investigated whether the PV carport system with charging stations can be realized economically. And the concept is then complemented by a hydrogen electrolysis plant, hydrogen storage and a fuel cell to convert and store surplus PV electricity into hydrogen. The PV system was designed in PV Sol and has a total capacity of 729.6 kilowatt peak. Four battery storage systems with a capacity of 60 kilowatt hours each were intended. The number of electric vehicles grows based on the German government's goal of 7 to 10 million electric cars in Germany by 2030. So that means an annual increase of 10 electric vehicles in the project. As a first result, the electricity taken from the grid increases as more electricity is required to charge the cars due to the growing number of electric vehicles. Throughout the runtime, the grid feed-in and the self-consumption decreases. But on the other hand, electricity taken from the grid for the buildings is increasing. The influencing parameters of the economic analysis are the electricity prices for grid purchase, grid feeding, and electric vehicle charging. Under the assumed parameters, the cumulative costs without realizing the project are greater than the cumulative costs of the solar carports during their lifetime. The PV carport system has a net present value of 230,000 euros, and the payback period is 19 years. The sensitivity analysis shows that the charging tariff, the investment costs, and the electricity price increase significantly influence the overall economic result. A change in any of these parameters can make it no longer advantageous to implement the project. Subsequently, a hydrogen electrolysis plant, hydrogen storage, and a fuel cell are added to the project, as you can see at the bottom of the poster, to convert and store surplus PV electricity. This could optimize the overall economic result. Thank you for listening.